Well, this is a, a view of Lake Aquila from the dam end and uh, looking out across the water I, I saw some uh, seismic crews down here just a few minutes ago from Polaris they're laying cable I, I didn't ask them and I wanted to how you would do seismic for a lake but I don't know if you can notice but there's some buoy like objects in the lake and you might not be able to see them, this may not bring them in real clearly but they're spaced across the water and um, I'm not sure how clear this is showing up, I can't see it very good but there's a number of them out on the surface of the lake I'm not sure if that's related to the seismic but I have yet, I've never seen those before so I would assume that it is there's quite a number along the shorelines, quite a, quite a few of them. I see, I count about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, just from where I'm at right now. And I cannot, and, and there's, it looks like there's quite a number more that I'm missing, but it, I can see something way out. It looks like across the water. So apparently they, they've got a way to do seismic across a lake. And uh, I don't know how they do it. If they drop the cable, you know, from a boat and it runs across the bottom. Or what? <laughs> Interesting. I'm going to go back, head back over here toward 933. Um, see what I can see over that direction. Now this is just uh, this is a little bit closer look at one of those buoys that I was talking about. I guess that's what you call a seismic buoy. I, I don't know, but I have never seen these across the lake before, so I'm assuming that's what it is. I can see some uh, shaker trucks up the road, and I'll be passing them here in just a minute up on the right hand side of the road up I'm, I'm headed towards the western side of the dam so uh, I'll ease up on these guys and see what's what they're doing I was told they're already they're already doing a lot of shaking around here so the seismic is underway okay here's the Here's the shaker, thumper trucks, whatever you want to call them, right up here on the right. Just looking over the edge here, a couple of uh, a couple of shaker trucks. A couple of shaker trucks right near the edge of the dam here from the western end. see quite plainly it's Polaris glad to see it there uh, there's another one up the road there a little bit of farther ahead we're right here at the lake so I've been getting after it apparently glad to see it They're, uh, I can hear them right now. Cut my car off for a second. And you can hear them. Hear the truck running. Shaker truck. They're longer than ones that I'm used to seeing, and maybe not as tall. I'm not sure. 
pretty good size. I'm not that. I'm about 50 yards from them. I'm gonna shut it down. More uh, more shaker trucks right here. I'm on the west end. Just just cross over the west side of the dam. And I need to. Uh, Turn my flasher so nobody will rear in me here. I've got the, the big uh, deal right down underneath the thing on the middle of it, so this is interesting. I'm, I've seen them before at the back. Definitely Polaris. Stop here for a minute. My camera went dead, but anyway, this is a Polaris shaker truck. And uh, they're probably wondering what the heck I'm doing, but you don't see this happening very often. As a matter of fact, it's the first time I've ever seen anything like this happening. Apparently, this one's broken down. They're doing some maintenance on it. The guy's working on the shaker truck underneath it. I hope they don't have too much trouble with it and get it back on the road soon.